20 North 7th Street. Uh, 1504 is just down that way. So this is the one that's on the corner. This is the driveway. I'm sorry, I parked in the driveway, but it's a very nice driveway. It's older, but it's really nice and wide for extra parking. Got a two-car garage, and it's like you can really fit a vehicle in there, which is nice. You got a screened-in porch over here. It's got a metal roof on the outside, so that is just fantastic. Very durable. Okay, it's got some really cute landscaping established. Um, got a fire hydrant this could be a discount on your homeowner's insurance they like to see that the outside looks like it could be power washed there's a chain link fence and I wanted to show you this backyard real quick very cute backyard yeah, I'm sure you've driven by here. If you haven't, go ahead and drive, drive by. There's no one living here, so you can peek through the windows or, or whenever we get a chance to meet up, I can get us in. outside is um, the asbestos um, siding as well. Got the original hard floors, huge big pen when you walk in. Very nice. It's got like an ancient heater right there, but I'm sure it works really well. Here is, I would say, the living room. Um, you know, you could make it just one big living room. Um, this would be the dining room, really. Um, we got some little space here. You could put like a table and put dishes and shelves or whatever right there if you wanted. Um, I would put some up to protect that anybody who's climbing up the stairs from possibly falling down. Um, those stairs are definitely, I don't know if those are original or what, but they're pretty steep. Here's the living room from this view. Um, there's another built-in behind the front door. The front door is super cute. Real hardwood. And here's bedroom number one. It's a pretty good size room. It looks like for this house does not have central heat and air. I forgot to look on the other one to see if it had central heat and air. Okay, here you go down the hallway and wait, there's our hall closet with the water heater. And I think this is an electric this is an electric water heater. It looks I don't think it's gas, but I don't know. Nice closet with some shelves, some hooks. And then here is, there's some attic storage there. And here's the bathroom. Tile floors, got some built-ins all the way up. Heater, that's a nice large sink. And you got some shelves. There's no storage except for those built-ins there. Nice size tub. It's the original tub. Nice cast iron. Steam shower. It's a nice bathroom. You wouldn't really have to do anything. Maybe some paint. Here's bedroom number two. Nice and bright to get afternoon sun here. So in the morning it's going to be dark. Um, that little screened-in porch that we saw from outside, here it is from inside, so it's off of a bedroom. There's a closet. 
Oh, good size closet. Here's the kitchen. And then we are back around. There's the dining room. And upstairs. This is like a little um, area to go outside. Um, nice patio here. Nice yard. This is the laundry. And it's huge. You got a sink in here. I would probably change that sink out to something bigger. You could put some tables in here. Um, looks like some storage. And, oh my gosh. Okay, so yeah, this could be cute. It needs some work. It's old. It looks original. Um, this is where the washer and dryer go here. It's electric. Medicine cabinet, old fashioned medicine cabinet. And another water heater. So, this is for the washer and dryer, I guess. The other one's for the house. Okay, so the garage is over there on the other side over there. And then there's like a little garden room over here on this side. So, we're going to look at the garden room real quick. compost area and then put your gardening tools and lawnmower or whatever back here or put your, just probably more gardening stuff okay. yeah I like this one better than the other one this one doesn't have any foundation. You got the extra room upstairs. And you'll see that in a separate video. Okay, here's the garage. I love the garage. It's huge. You could fit a vehicle in here easy too. So this is a nice size garage. You got lots of storage. You could put stuff up high. Looks like all the way across. I love these kind of garages. And here's the driveway, lots of parking. Cute house. 